This is from my short story, The Devil You Know. As soon as we were alone, Adam walked around and around admiring me. Me, Adam, you Eve. Naturally, I ignored him, rude individual. Not so much as a how do you do or I believe we're related through our bone structure. He thought I didn't understand when I refused to answer him. I suppose I'll have to teach you how to talk, he said. I was created knowing how to use languages, but you'll need lessons. We'll do two hours every morning. I had a secret self he was unaware of. I could speak just as well as him, if not better, but I preferred to let Adam think he was shaping and improving me if it pleased him, as it did. And so our life in paradise developed a pattern. Adam bossing me around and me resisting being bossed, unless it suited me. He was happy with his God-given companion, but between you and me, there were times when I was irritated by the arrangement. Often, God dropped in for a visit, but old Beardy never paid much attention to me. I saw through him. It made him uneasy. It was clear he only wanted to boast about something new he'd invented in that junk shop of his. You should have seen him strut the day he created the rainbow. One day, I met an amazing creature. Looking back, I suppose he was lying in wait for me. My new friend was sleek, eye-catching, charming and interested in me. With legs, he'd have been perfect. <laughs>